get some practice get some practice one day two day three day in this way it will be your habit because habit is the key to your better life better future oil well, it's me soilis welcome to my channel sbrc infosys nepal so if you are new to this channel please go to the description you will find the link to our playlist and other video are uploaded in this playlist well guys in this 13th video of front-end development i'm gonna teach you about html with css part 3 let's start in our computer screen okay guys now we are in our computer screen uh, open any text editor like sublime text and uh, then you can open a new file uh, here you can type uh, any code um, some code of basic code of html then under the body you can type here um, make one division uh, this division's name is the box and um, you can uh, set here style um, box uh, width under the style box width uh, uh, 240px and height also 240px you can set uh, whatever and the background color is red and i'm going to set the border width uh, for 10 px let's see how it look like this yeah this is the output uh, our box is like this and when you uh, set the border color then it will not working still now because we have uh, three elements um, one is width and next one is uh, border color and next one is style border style we have to need uh, to set the border styles or also so border styles uh, so many styles uh, you can see here um, uh, first one is solid let's see how it look like yeah solid uh, when I said this border style solid this one is look like this yeah and you can also set the dotted dot is means like this dot dot uh, you can see here um, all border is inside the um, box and also you can say the dash this one is also border style we have seen the border styles uh, dotted styles and uh, um, and next i'm going to show you how many types of border styles here you can see solid double uh, grove dotted dash in, uh, inset border on border outset border riders and so on a hidden broad border you can see you can use any one um, but now i'm uh, I have uh, show you to three types of uh, um, style border one is solid dash and um, dotted you can see here and uh, also you can use this uh, like this uh, border is cost to 10 px green solid all code are uh, this you to here this code is uh, working by this code you can remove this because uh, this single line code is also working uh, like this code you can remove this one uh, still same result uh, you I'm going to comment this you don't need to uh, set uh, different different like border with border color 
in personal personally uh, you can set like border is cost to uh, you can set here and you can also set the um, border is in left side or right side particularly you can set this and left is who is color or who is uh, um, styles you can set like this uh, left right top and button in this way you can set uh, like this for example i'm going to set the uh, left is solid and right is uh, for example um you can change the order uh, like this uh, you don't need to set uh, which one is uh, first and second you, you can set um, where you want um, before or after it doesn't matter mm, I'm going to change the color of uh, uh, those border first one is green second one is brown yellow and pink let's see how it look like wow nice and uh, i'm going to uh, set the um, height and width uh, 1 px and height also 1 px yeah this one is look like this <coughs> uh, when i remove this uh, it will be uh, look like this so if i need to remove then you can uh, set the task parent uh, i'm going to show you how it look like this when i set the task parent um, uh, transparent transparent I'm going to set only right side others are transparent this one is look like this and uh, our background color I'm going to remove this one then now it is look like this Wow okay mm. and you can change uh, like this now top is Okay, then uh, yeah, then it will be look like top side, and I'm going to show you uh, this one is um, used used for uh, like this. When you need to make like this, then you can. You need to this one. I'm going to show you by inspect element uh, after uh, then here. You can see here border left right. Uh, like this uh, top is say the color and others left right bottom will be transparent this one is same result of this okay guys now I'm going to comment this and I'm I'm uh, going to show you um, border width it goes to 10 px and border style it goes to solid the next one is border color it goes to um, which one brown okay then you can like this you can um, say the first one is brown then others are transparent this one is also same result by three line code uh, code this means um 10 px 10 px 10 px this one is top uh, right button and left you can remove or set it doesn't matter and first one is top is solid then uh, right dotted in this way button then left you can set also remove it doesn't matter and here is also uh, same rules
I'm going to make new uh, uh, boxes uh, and copy this code paste and this box name is box one uh, now I'm going to change the direction of this here yeah, this one is in second part um, right side this color is red this is the uh, rules of CSS first one is stop then left then down then so top right down and left now guys this one is I'm going to remove this um, okay width is goes to 200 px and height is goes to also 200 px and background color is and has 999 has 999 is the color code um, and this one is this color and I need to this uh, content uh, under the box then we have to uh, make a one paragraph under this uh, division uh, like this you can also uh, paste this one is look like this but we have to need the um, some space uh, margin space uh, text align is goes to justify justify this one is all our um, equals then we have to need the this uh, um, padding from here uh, we need to padding then what shall I do guys okay you have to uh, you can see her I'm going to show you um here is also box one uh, it's just for i'm going to show you um, this one is also float it's goes to left here is also float it's goes to left uh, now i'm going to show you one different uh, some issues uh, so i'm going uh, i have making this box um, I'm going to set here padding its cost to 50 px. Now it is working, but here is um uh, box width is increased, height and width is increased, or uh, but our uh, height and width is same both boxes, but there is boxes uh, size is different out in output so then how how can we arrange this um, box width and height this one is working but there is some problem this is the problem okay guys we don't need to too much large This is the main issue. Um, in this, uh, in this case, you can say the border sizing is goes to border box. Now this one is working like this. Our content is mm, too much. Um, Okay, I'm remove some content now. This is awesome. Now this one is uh, same size, height and width by using the box sizing element. Then I'm going to change the padding um, 
from top is 50 px and left and right is 30 px you can set one side and then uh, opposite side is also same uh, size same padding uh, you can set also 0 to mm, next one then it will be working like this yeah, left side is mm, you can set here 0 then uh, it will be look like this 0 from here to here this one is mm, too much gap okay i'm going to now margin it's close to uh, 50px uh, when you set the margin then it uh, it will be nah, there is some problem like this then uh, when you set the top is zero then um, right is 50 px then other will be uh, zero zero also you can set like this uh, margin right is goes to 50 px this one is margin only 50 px like this uh, you can set here um, then margin left is goes to 50 px margin uh, it goes to 0 50 px you can set like this also uh, if you uh, need to multiple data then you can set in one line code margin is goes to uh, blah 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 four times top top right down and uh, left if you uh, need to only one data then you can set margin left or margin right which goes to this one margin uh, top which goes to blah 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 uh, you can set like this whatever you want um, uh, and guys now I'm going to show you how is this uh, okay then um, margin left it goes to 450 px uh, this one is also uh, I'm going to set in um, center okay this one is center when you set the like this uh, margin uh, this when you zoom uh, in and zoom out then it will be uh, change the direction of center like this so <clears throat> you have to uh, set the margin left is goes to auto Mm, auto then you have to remove this float is goes to left now uh, it will be in uh, left right side sorry right side um, and uh, again you, you have to um, you have to set this um, same code margin auto uh, margin 
left is equals to auto and you have to also set margin right is equals to auto then it will be in center uh, then you can change the zoom in zoom out then it will be always it will be in center okay guys mm, this one is I'm going to remove this this one is removed okay now I'm going to make a new project this one is blank here is a white color uh, white color why this one is, this page is white by default because our body default color of body uh, element is white color so I need to um, uh, another color then you can set here um, body uh, if user defined uh, and classes you can set dot something um, class name or uh, if you use um, ID then has then ID but body is the uh, element so directly you can uh, type body like this then bo body color is gray then output is also gray I need to <clears throat> another class page then uh, then I set here dot page uh, page is uh, page width is 980 px and height is uh, not um, accurate but um, I'm going to set here uh, 500 px and background color is um, white okay now how is look like uh, okay this one is look like this but um, I need to this one is in center um, like this from to from this one is um, page um, but this one is uh, left side uh, I need to center then uh, in same case a uh, margin is cost margin is cost to auto then this one is on center <clears throat> but in top side uh, there is some gaps uh, you can set here margin is cost to zero padding is cost to zero then um, you can see here uh, this margin and padding zero zero uh, this is uh, on this code is used for everywhere so you can set here um, in top side uh, with asterisk asterisk means uh, all code this used to uh, use in all phases uh, to all code uh, like this now you can set here then this one is working like this okay guys mm, uh, now I'm going to um, making a new division under the um, page uh, this division name is header um, uh, headers uh, style is um, heading height is cost to 120 px and border color is cost to red now how is look like yeah this one is look like this uh, and guys mm, uh, I need to <coughs> some changes mm, 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 okay with uh, page which is close to 980 px 
this one is <coughs> uh, full screen width but uh, our face is 980 px so that okay now the header there is a logo and contact number uh, we need to logo uh, in uh, left side and contact number is right side then we have to set um, color is equals to white and um, header font size is equals to 22 px um, now body font family is equals to lato lato is installed in my computer okay uh, <clears throat> mm, again I, uh, I'm said the uh, logo <clears throat> in, in division logo and next one is info and dot logo uh, float left and dot info float right now this one is left and right this one is working but uh, there is mm, no padding uh, if this one is on top side we have to need the in here center <clears throat> then how to manage it in logo you can set here border is cost to 2px solid uh, this one is f just for <clears throat> you understand yeah when you say the margin 30 px margin then th this one is working like this if you set the margin uh, if you set the padding it's cost to 30 px then it will be working like this full this um, height and width also increased so uh, you can look here <coughs> like this uh, maybe you can understand <coughs> uh, again i'm set the info padding is cost to 30 px this one is also like this <coughs> okay you can also say the um, he heading padding then you, you can remove from here uh, then it's this one is same result but um, heading uh, height is increased then you can also set your border sizing is goes to border box then it will be in default stage this is the our output guys in this way I, uh, we have to make this um, we have to practice this guys now this padding is working like this okay guys thank you thank you for watching the video guys if you are new to this channel please do not forget to subscribe our channel if you are already part of the channel do not forget to practice every day and do not forget to share with your friend
because selling is caring. If you enjoy this one, I'd like to say make sure to subscribe our channel to never miss an update and hit that like button. It will be motivate me to make new videos. So leave the comment below, hashtag challenge accepted and do practice every day.